Hey, what's up everybody? Today is July 1st and I'm working on a new project. So lately I have uh, been trying uh, to grow peppers in these uh, mini hydroponic container made from a baby formula bottle. So what I did was um, initially this plant here was one of those plants that really didn't want to grow. So it, it grew to a certain size, like probably like an inch and a half and it just stopped growing. Uh, I did everything I could but it still it just would not grow so after a few months it's still the same size so I took it out and put it into a little mini uh, hydroponic kit and then it got so big that I moved it into this one so today what I'm gonna do is do the same thing for this Carolina Reaper so I've had this plant here for probably four months in this container and it just did not grow at all. It's uh, I, I don't know what it why maybe because the container is too small or something, but I, I think it even so it should grow much bigger than it is right here. So it's it's been a long time and it just stays the same and just will not grow. So what I did was I took all the, the dirt out, so, uh, uh, pull this plants out here. So this is what it looks like. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna clean all this up, then. I'm going to take this container, then I'm going to drill a hole with this in here. I might have to cut this uh, one side here so that I can feed the roots in because it's already long. So I'll be back with you guys. Uh, let me drill a hole with this and then clean that up and then I'll put it together and let you guys see it. I'll be back in a bit. Alright, so I got my drill ready. So this is a one inch drill that would uh, match perfectly up to that one. So what you're going to do is you're going to take this container here and there's a little spot right there already so you really don't need to uh, sort of like measure where the center is. It has the little thing there already so you can use it as a guide. So you're going to drill this in. Alright, so once that's stuck, you want to drill this backward. That way, uh, it just works better. Oop. And so let me put this down and I'll, I'll, I'll show it to you. So drill it in and then turn the drill to go the other way, the reverse. Alright, I'll be back in a bit. Alright guys, I'm back. So I got this whole drill. And then I've also got the plants all cleaned up nice and clean. And that's the best I could do. And what we'll do next is you also want to use this uh, like a rock wool cube. And what what I'll do here is I'll just it it could be dry, it doesn't have to be wet. So I'll tear this in half, just like that. Not not all the way, just so that then you want to take your plants and then sort of like wrap it in here, like that. Make sure the, the leaves are above the rock wool so it doesn't rot. Just like that. And then you're going to put this into your net cup. I mentioned earlier you might need to cut it but let's just see if we can pull this through. You might, might not need to cut anything. So just work your way. Try not to damage the root because that's um, is going to slow down your growth process. So just try to get it all down to the bottom without damaging it. Then push this down to the bottom of the cup. So, I think we've got it. Alright, so it's going to look like that. Then you put this in here. But first what I'm going to do is I'm going to fill that up with nutrients first. And then I'll put that cup in. That way it's easier. So just open it like that.
and I have my nutrients already pre-mixed. Just shake it. Stir it up. Then I'm just gonna pour that in here. And you wanna do it so that the the bottom of the net cup just barely touched the water. So put that in here, just force it down a little. And this should be enough, but I wanna fill it up a little bit more. So you just do that. Just a little bit more. Alright, so that's about touch it. And that's that's all I'm gonna do. So I'll keep this uh, progress going and then I'll keep you guys updated. So I, I think this will work because it, it worked for this one here. See how well that is? How well that worked? And then I have my other ones. And th those already have fruits on them. See? Right there. And there's, there's just tons of flowers. So uh, for these, uh, what? Well, if you have plants that just refuse to grow like this one, this one I mentioned earlier, it's it's probably four to five months old, and it's just I probably did something wrong. That's why it didn't grow. But in a, in a few weeks, you're gonna see this grow like crazy, and this one too. It just didn't grow at all. This one is about a few months old as well. But it just it didn't grow until a few weeks ago when I put this in here. But anyway, I'll keep you guys updated. Uh, if you guys have any questions or comments, make sure to leave it below. Alright, see you in the next video.